here it is, the Bikini Bottom Animal Shelter. Your perfect pet awaits. Now, if you just listen to your heart, you'll be able to pick out the right pet as soon as you see it. Hmm, too big. Too sloppy. Too stupid. Hi, SpongeBob. Hey, Patrick. Oh, oh, what about this one? Are you kidding me? Algae on a rock? I want a pet, not a plant. It's no use. There's nothing for me here. Oh, no! Hi, Daddy! You know, I can't say I'm surprised. Hey there, little guy. <laughs> looks like we have a winner. Oh, so cute. What you gonna call him? He looks like a spot to me. That name provokes a violent reaction. Spot it is. <laughs> Gary! Gary? Gary? Gary, there you are. What are you doing here when today is the day we get to show everyone else you're the best pet in the whole world? Now for a quick checklist. Let's see, eyes talk reflexes? Check. Slime viscosity. Again, Squidward. Yellow. Check. And last but not least, a quick undercarriage check. <laughs> oh, okay. Maybe we better skip that one. What did you say? say? Well, I didn't say anything. I didn't say anything either. See, See you later, later man. man. All right, quit messing with me. I know you said something. Uh, but it is you that is messing with me. That's what's messing with us. It's a baby scallop. I'll take care of this. No, Patrick, it's totally helpless. It looks like he can't even fly yet. Well, what's the matter? Is he stupid? No, Patrick, he's just a baby. He's all alone with no one to take care of him. Well, we, we can't just leave him out here. You're right. Come on, let's take him into the pineapple. Oh, let's see. We need a box for him to sleep in. There you go. It's the best seat in the house. Let me see. Hey, it's getting cute. Uh-oh. I think somebody's hungry. Is it you? Are you hungry? I got just a thing. How would you like a Krabby Patty? SpongeBob SquarePants, are you crazy? That's not the right food for a little fella like him. Of course not. I don't know what I was thinking. What he needs is a tiny Krabby Patty. Ugh. Huh? No one's ever turned down one of these before. Let's try a donut. French fries? A donut? All we have left is this apple. Hello, sea creatures. I bring you greetings from Apple World. Of course, scallops love worms. Oh, wait, we will bury you. Well, you should be good for the rest of the. What now? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, don't cry. Do something, SpongeBob. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Look at the funny face. <laughs> Look at the funny face. <laughs> Look at the funny face. Wait, I think I might know the problem. Yep, that's it, all right. Hold on just one second. Here he is, good as new. <laughs> Now, Gary never minds running into a friend. But old Patrick here don't seem ready to share his meal. Oh, Gary feels as big as a ten-point buck right now. But he's about to be reminded that life ain't all fun and games. 
Especially when animal control is on your tail. <laughs> Free fly ball! Ow. As much as Gary likes getting one over on the heat, he has more important matters to attend to. This here's Old Plankton's restaurant, the Chum Bucket. Gary ain't here for vittles, though. No one's ever at the Chum Bucket for vittles. That there spot. Plankton's pet amoeba and Gary's best friend. Spot's cute, but about as dumb as a barrel of hair. Gary better think quick, or they'll both be busted before their night's even begun. Spot have been sneaking out for ages, though their owners are none the wiser. <laughs> they love playing all sorts of games together, but their doggone favorite is wrestling. <laughs> it's the Krusty Krab Kitchen. What a stroke of luck. Gary and Spot must have worked up quite an appetite with all them fun and games. Uh-oh, that ice box is locked up tighter than a horse thief in a who's gal. <laughs> oh boy, it's chow time. <laughs> <laughs> Patrick, maybe we should play something that involves less thinking. Okay. Hey! Maybe we can play a game with this ball that was buried under here. Ball! Let me see it! What a weird ball. Well, who knows how long it's... Oh! Mother of Neptune! Get it away from me! Get it away from me! There's nothing to be afraid of, SpongeBob. It's just a little worm. See? You're right, Patrick. I'm sorry we destroyed your nest, little worm. I promise it won't happen again. Look, Patrick. Looks like he's taking a fancy to you. Yeah. Hey, why don't we invite Mr. Wormsley to stay at my place? At least until his nest grows back. That sounds delightful. Harry! Make yourself decent. Bob, you have a visitor. Gary, wake up! That's right. Just bring him in here. Careful, careful. That's right. Oh, hi, Gary. Are you ready to meet your new friend? That's right. Say hello to Mr. Wormsley. Something tells me they don't like each other. Come on, now, guys. Come on. Let's touch soft parts in a friendly manner. Just saying hi. That's it. There you go. That's it. Oh, I knew you could get along. There, there you go. See, friends. Ow! Oh my goodness, Patrick! Ow! Oh, Patrick, please do something! Ow! Oh, uh, SpongeBob, I gotta get going. I'll check in on you later and see how your new pet is doing. Okay? Okay, Patrick. See you later. Hello. <laughs> Gary, there's something inside of me. You see anything? <laughs> Gary. 
Larry the Snail. Is that any way to treat an uninvited guest? Oh, hello. Ooh, that tickles. More like prickles. Hey, I think I'll call you Prickles. Ah, I see you. Ah, okay, okay, enough's enough. It's time for you to go, little guy. I already have a pet, Gary. I'm afraid I just don't need another one. <laughs> Gary, I don't like to hear the little guy cry. <laughs> Such a sad story. <laughs> okay, little buddy, but just for one night. Nighty night, pickle. inside of me. Hey, why wasn't I invited? Ah, I guess I was, since I am the house. Look, Gary, now we have tons of prickly new friends. Wow, wow. Three thousand whoop who's later. We lost all track of time. Hey, uh, sorry to be a party pooper, guys, but I gotta take a shower and get ready for work. <laughs> guys, guy, guys. Oh, 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 oh. Gary, calm down. We're all friends here. <laughs> or something. He's in here. No, I can't look. SpongeBob? Yes? Something tells me Mr. Wormsley is actually a Mrs. Wormsley. <gasps> oh, Patrick, it's a miracle. That it is. Wait till Gary sees. Yeah, wait till. See, Gare? They're right in here. Quiet now. They were born less than... <laughs> Looks like they're still not quite used to each other. Well, these things take time. This town is getting too rough for me. Where? Where? Food? Where? Where? Protect garden. <laughs> Only thing that makes life worth living. <laughs> Peanuts. What the? These peanut worms are pets, not vegetables. <laughs> Warning you, I have a blunt instrument here and I'm not afraid to use it. <laughs> there you are, sucker! 
Cucumbers squirting me! Flying stuff! <laughs> Patrick could spare a few morsels. After all, it's for a worthy cause, me beloved Pearl. <laughs> Don't worry, Pearl. Daddy found you some vittles. <laughs> Bottom feeders. I brought you some... <laughs> Cereal. More, Daddy! More! There, there, my darling. The bad man is gone now. And if he comes back, we'll make sure he never walks again. Which way did you say the kidnapper ran, Miss... Uh, Mrs... Uh, Ms... Mrs... Miss... Miss Mrs. Uh, <clears throat> so, uh, which way'd you say he went? I said he went that way. Anything else? No. Got it. Johnson? Well, looks like whoever it was is gone now, ma'am. Enjoy the rest of your evening. I tell you, these calls are getting more and more weird. I mean, what kind of nutcase would want to break into someone's vegetable garden at this time of night? Well, my daddy's gonna turn up anywhere near here again tonight. What do you say we go check out that new 24-hour taser emporium you were talking about? Did you have to catch him that easily? I demand the release of this poor woodland creature. He's got rights too, you know. This is none of your business, SpongeBob. Go away. You want him? You can keep him. Saves me a trip to the incinerator. Hooray! <laughs> I'm warning you, SpongeBob. Keep that filthy animal away from my... Vegetables! That's what you like, isn't it, Bunny? We'll see what we got in the fridge. <laughs> Whoops, I'm out of veggies, but I got something even better. Gary's food, yay! Does Bunny want to like his Denny Winnie? <laughs> All right, Gary's food is out, got it. I'll get you veggies, I'll be right back. Chew-proof this whole house fast. Hot sauce ought to do the trick. SpongeBob? Gary? How dare you invade the sanctity of my dreams? Gary, you can talk! <sighs> In dreams, one is not tethered by earthly limitations. What does that mean? Come. For ages, dreams have been thought of as windows to another realm. 
Let me not mar that perfect dream by an oral stain, but so adjust my daily night that it may come again. Emily Dickinson wrote that. Who? Oh? Here's one you might know. <clears throat> there once was a man from Peru who dreamed he was eating his shoe. He woke with a fright in the middle of the night to find that his dream had come true. Ah, gee, Gary, you sure are smart. Did you think my shell was full of hot air? Well, thanks for the info, Gary. I'm going back to my own dream now. Beware of your wandering eye, you little peripheron. Ah, this looks neat. I wonder... Hey, SpongeBob, what brings you here? Hey, Sandy, what's going on? Well, we're free falling from 114,000 feet, and we're gonna land on that itty-bitty target. This seems kind of dangerous. Not as long as you got a big old parachute. Okay. <laughs> Not parachute, SpongeBob, parachute. Gotcha. Not a parakeet, para... Medic. Oh, there you are, boy. Come to me. Jump in my arms and give me your precious kisses. <laughs> Good amoeba. You get a num num. <laughs> Plankton, have you been feeding Spot a lot of treats lately? He's looking bigger than usual. Karen, not in front of the amoeba. Spot is fit as a fiddle. All right, doctor, if you say so. Come on, I'll prove it. Now you'll see how healthy my little Spotty Waddy is. <laughs> Pregnant? Ah, that can't be right. I thought he was a boy. I'm not sure it matters for amoebas. Food-rich environments cause amoebas to reproduce. And you've certainly provided a food-rich environment. Who's gonna be a mama? Good boy. We're not ready to have puppies, Karen. This is all happening a little too fast. We have to set up a state-of-the-art delivery room, sanitize everything, baby-proof the chum bucket. Wait. Where's Spot? What the? Puppy! You did it, boy! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay! Wait, is that my good dinner jacket? Oh, who cares about a dinner jacket? Oh, oh, I'm down, Karen. You don't want to blow out your motherboard. No, oh, I'm gonna name you Steven and Karen and Clayton and Vincent and Q. Overload. Oh, sure. You take a couple of hours to reboot, Karen. It's fine. I'll just manage all these puppies all on my own. Hey! Get down from there! Stop that! My furniture! My experiments! Bad amoebas! Bad! I don't get it, Karen. Spot is so well-behaved, but the puppies don't listen to me at all. I think we need to get rid of them. Worm sign. He's in that cave. Sandy, are you sure you... Of course I am. I'm going in, and I ain't coming out till I got me a big heaping plate of worm stew. <laughs> Aha! There you are, you tail-nabbing varmint! Hoi! <laughs> Oh, 
this is the tongue, and the whole thing is the worm. Run for your life! <laughs> <laughs> So what's the plan, Sandy? Run faster! I can't buy that. Hey, wait a minute! I was right, wasn't I? Later! Ah, uh, he is too big for you, isn't he? Not now, SpongeBob! I want to hear you say it. Can we talk about this some other time? Say it! SpongeBob! Say it or I'll trip you! No! Get away! Say it! Not now! Say it! Okay! You were right and I was wrong! I was wrong, 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 wrong! Are you happy now? I knew it. Welcome to the cru- Sorry, sir, but the Krusty Krab has a strict no-pet policy. I'm afraid your worm will have to wait outside. Oh, I could never do that. He gets far too lonely and upset when he's left alone. Sorry, buddy. I guess I can't buy you that Krabby Patty you wanted. Let's just go home. Hey! Hey! Let's not be hasty! Now, why didn't you just say you were buying your pet a Krabby Patty? Listen, I tell you what, for your troubles, I'll give you two Krabby Patties at regular price. SpongeBob, give this responsible pet owner two Krabby Patties. Responsible pet owner? I leave Gary home by himself every day. I'd better call him and make sure he's okay. Too distraught to even answer the phone. Hello, you reach SpongeBob and. Come on, Gary. Meow. Gary. Bah. The two of us are having too much fun together to answer the phone right now. So leave a message and we'll call you right back if we ever get a break from having so much fun together. Bah. My outgoing message is a lie. Gary, are you there? Gary and SpongeBob just checking in. If you're there, pick up. Every daddy will be home soon. Morning, old timer. Can we pet him, mister? Sure, but be gentle. <laughs> <laughs> What's all the hubbub out here? <laughs> what the? <laughs> so Patrick's a horse now? <laughs> Your phony baloney pony's more like an old gray mare. <laughs> Sorry to say, but uh, this one's ready for the glue factory. <laughs> what kind of <laughs> What are you doing violating me personal space? <laughs> Horsey rides. Kids love horses. Great idea having Patrick play pony. I'll charge these kids ten bucks a ride and cash in big time. Oh, I don't know, Mr. Krabs. I think Patrick will only let me ride him. Oh, nonsense. Pony rides and buckaroos. <laughs> Patrick, give me up. Now, I don't mean to nag, so don't bridle when I say this, but your dream horse is more like a nightmare. Ha! Get it? Nightmare. Ha! Ha! <laughs> oh, yeah, now you're feeling your oats. <laughs> I'm so good. <laughs> Four at a time quadruplicates more money. Let's try for five. My little wig! I'll take that one right there. You wish to obtain one of my rare and extremely dangerous... Huh? Oh, yeah, this is the one. Beware, boy. This is no ordinary pet. <laughs> Gary's gonna be so happy. You must understand. These creatures can be very unstable, especially around other pets. <laughs> Why 
Why bother? They never listen. Good. Sheriff, I nabbed your bank robber. There's your culprit right there. Now cuff him. Hello, Gary! Oh, I brought you a surprise! Your very own Palapal! His name is Puffy Fluffy, and he'll keep you company while I'm at work. You two get to know each other. I'll be right back. Mom. Eat up, you two. Gary! What happened to your manners? You be nice and share with Puffy Fluffy. Come here, you. There you go, Fluffy. Now eat up. I'm gonna go make some enchiladas. Oh. Oh, these enchiladas are hot, hot, hot! Gerald, it is not nice to ignore new friends. Why don't you two play a little? That will help you bond. Great! Now my enchiladas are cold. <laughs> what? Gary, what has gotten into you, boy, huh? Because you refuse to show the least bit of respect for our new friend, and because you have ruined my enchilada dinner, I have no choice but to put you to siesta early tonight. I hope you're happy now. Ah. Good. Maybe you could extend that happiness to your new friend. Aw, look at you two. So cute together. Ah. I accept your apology, Gary. Now you be good to him. Good night. I am going to sleep so well knowing that Gary's got a good buddy to take care of him. <laughs> Gary, shame on you. Puffy Fluffy is perfectly harmless. See, there he is, fast asleep. Now, will you let me sleep, Gary, please? Good night. Everyone. Excellent, SpongeBob. <laughs> okay, let's go. Huh? Aged Krabby Patties here. Get your artisanal aged Krabby Patties here. Did I mention they were free? <laughs> His fur looks silkier than actual silk. Yes. Make them all see me, SpongeBob. Make them all see. Cuddle, eat, hugs. SpongeBob! <laughs> what are you doing giving away free food? Are you quick? <laughs> 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 I can't resist the fuzzy. <laughs> Come, everyone, and hug your new best friend. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no cuddly hugs, no! Yes, SpongeBob SquarePants, yes! Ah! Oh, sorry I'm late, I... <laughs> um, back to bed. <laughs> I thought we were friends! <laughs> what happened? <laughs> oh. Well, your friend ate me is what happened. Not cool! <laughs> yeah, grumble! Sorry, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> you need to imagine your friends were
more carefully, SpongeBob? I just don't get it. Why did he act like that last night? I thought we were BFFs. I need to talk to him. <laughs> Crazy time last night, right, bro? Don't bro me, cuddly hugs. You embarrassed me last night and you ate all my friends. Why would you do that? Didn't you ever wonder what the E in my name stands for? It's eat! I'm always hungry, you know? Oh, well, why didn't you say so? Here, have the last of my patty. <laughs> Wait, no! No! What? Oh, pallets. We're uh, ready to start here, folks. Okay, Snelly, let's show these common garden variety snails what superior breeding is all about. Meow. All right, Gary, listen up. The competition is gonna be fierce. You're the undersnail. Everybody's already counting you out. Now get out there and win so we can rub Squidward's big fat nose in it. Meow. This is what you've been training for, Rocky. This is why we're here. On your mark, get set, slither. Number six, Snelly, rockets out of the starting blocks, leaving the other two competitors in the dust. Go, what? Snelly, you got it, baby. What are you doing, Gary? The race has started. You let Snelly take the lead. Let's go, Gary, start moving. You're blowing everything we trained for. Blowing it. It's OK, Rocky. You go when you feel like it. Gary, are you listening to me? Get the anchors out of your pants right now! Don't give me that look. I said now, mister. Get going, Gary! Go, 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 go! And there goes number seven out of the starting gate. Oh, hang on, folks. He doesn't look so good. Not good enough, Gary. Not good enough. Faster! <laughs> I do not like the look of this. Come on, Gary, it's a race, a race! Have you heard of him? <laughs> that coach is pushing that snail too hard. Faster, Gary, faster, 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 faster! Uh, uh, huh? Oh, looks like number seven has a blowout. <laughs> oh, make that two, folks. Oh. Uh, Gary? Plus a blown head gasket. Oh, and the poor creature's still going for it. Um, Gary, you can stop now. And he's losing control. <laughs> you can take a break now if you want to, Gary. He's spinning out of control. <laughs> he's heading straight for the wall. seems to have raced onto the track. That is an automatic disqualification. Looks like number six has this race all wrapped up, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, Snelly, it's all you, Vinny! Oh, Gary, I'm sorry. Why did you just say I was pushing it too hard? You did? Oh, Gary, why did you tell me I wasn't listening? You did? Oh, Gary! Oh, Gary! What? Huh? Gary? What's wrong with me? Do I offend? <laughs> hey, Gary! Gary, look! It's your favorite ball! <laughs> Hey, Gary! Look! Snail nip! Gary, help! Help me, oh, merciful Neptune! I closed the window on my head! <laughs> All right, that's it! Ah! <laughs> Gary, you stay. 
stop this foolishness right now. <laughs> Gary the Snail, answer me when I'm talking to you. Okay, that's it, mister. You are coming home with me right this instant. <laughs> Say goodbye to Patrick, Gary. Hold it right there, Dad, Mom, Angry Pants. What's that supposed to mean? I don't know, but I do know Gary knows who he wants to go with. Now I suggest you put him down and let him choose. Fine, but I would like to remind him who it was that fed him and housed him and sat at his bedside when he was sick and massaged his eye stalks when his eyes were sore. Okay, Gary, go ahead, show him. Okay, Gary, come to me. Come on, come on, Gary. Come on, come here, Gary. Oh, wrong way, Gary. G Gary, turn around, Gary, turn around. G Gary, no, Gary, no, 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 no. Don't do it, Gary. <laughs> no, Gary. Well, well, well. I guess that answers that question. Ghost, get the cute little stray snail. How about I call you Louie? Lighthouse Louie. <laughs> now, Louie, you be good while Uncle SpongeBob cleans. Stop, Louie! Oh. Louie, I'm afraid you'll have to play out here, little fella, for your own safety. What, Louie? Hmm. Well, that ought to keep you out of my hair. Sorry, Louie. You have to stay outside. No silly little snail is a match for my superior sponge brain. Bait, one cano patty. <laughs> gotcha! I don't gotcha! You got me! Particles that's heavy! Huh? Ah! Huh? Where do we go? Louie! 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 So this is where you've been hiding. <laughs> Nice nail. Good, Louie. No, no, no. no. Ah! <laughs> 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 Whoa! Those dudes are huge. I wonder what they lift. <gasps> Those are dudes. They're giant monsters. Everybody, run! <laughs> Buff monsters have vanished! We're saved! You're doomed! I'm gonna get a pet who won't go off with my best friend! <laughs> Hi, guys! Say hello to my new pal, Rex! Not only is he loyal, but he knows tricks, too. Watch and learn. Sit, Rex, sit. Roll over, Rex, roll over. Now stay, Rex, stay. Good boy, Rex. 
Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? <laughs> I'm sure glad we went our separate ways, Gary. A worm really is the pet for me. So loyal, so trusting, always by my side! <laughs> Who needs worms anyway? Welcome home, newest best friend. Come on out, don't be shy. <laughs> you remind me of someone I once knew. A certain someone whose name will not be mentioned in this household. Come on, let me show you around. Larry. Meow. And now, Larry, I present to you... Dinner time! Ta-da! Bon appetit, Larry! <laughs> okay, maybe later. This is where you sleep, Larry. Uh, that's where I... I guess you can sleep there. I'll sleep down here. Well, good night, Larry. Because of her mysterious behavior, I have decided to name her Mystery. Hmm. Now that I think about it, she's also very graceful and majestic. Perhaps I should name her Grace or Majesty or Debbie. She must have spotted my floral bookmark. She's coming this way. That's it, girl. Don't be afraid. I'm just a talking sponge is all. Do you think we'll be friends forever? I'll take that as a yes. Welcome, little worm. Here at the Krusty Krab, it's a pet paradise. Enjoy yourself, and don't forget to order something to eat. Oh, uh, I'll order for you. <laughs> hey, man, can I, like, get a Krabby Patty to go? Sorry, pets only. You can try your luck across the street. Oh, I don't want to eat chum. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> the house special! <sighs> it's great that my pets are eating and all, but I'm still hungry. <laughs> I wish I was a pet so I could eat off the floor. You are eating off the floor. Yeah, but... I want to eat Krabby Patties off the floor. The pink dude might have the right idea, guys. If we dress up like pets, we could trick crabs into serving us, of course. If you want to make costumes, I have a craft corner. Oh, boy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, construction paper. Oh, boy. Anyone seen the glue? <laughs> Now's my chance to sneak into the crusty crab in my pet spot. <laughs> hey, what's happening? No spot. Stop digesting me, spot. Bad spot. No! We gotta get in there, Squidward. Mr. Krabs is counting on us. Hey, SpongeBob, isn't that the mattress over there? Terrific, Patrick. You found it. What? Where? Where? Let me see. Over there, Squidward.
Squidward, underneath that really big guard worm. Oh, that figures. Oh, no. This is horrible. What is it, Doctor? This man has no insurance. He'll never be able to afford this room. You're right, nurse. Extract the patient to the hallway. Stat! <laughs> well, that's Mr. Krabs' mattress, all right. Let's go get it. Okay, here's the plan. You two quietly go in there. Remove the mattress out from under the guard worm without... Waking the worm. Why not? Because that would be rude, Patrick. And nothing's meaner than a junkyard worm. He'll eat you alive! Oh, well, hey, wait a minute. What are you gonna do? Oh, I got the most important job. I'm going to keep watch to make sure it's safe. Gee, thanks, buddy. My pleasure. Now let's get a move on. <laughs> Isn't it beautiful, Patrick? You can see everything from up here. Whoa. Ah. Oh, what are you morons doing? Hey, Patrick, I think I can see our houses from here. Where? I can't see them. <laughs> wow. <laughs> do it again. What did you idiots do? Squidward, what are you doing in there? You were supposed to keep watch. Yeah, and you woke up the guard worm, too. I didn't do it. You blockheads woke. Doctor? Yes, Doctor. Regarding your patient, Doctor, I have come to this conclusion. Yes, go on. We have to surgically remove him from out in front of the candy machine so I can get to the Nutty Nut Bar. Of course. Nurse! I'm on it. Worm bait to retriever. Worm bait to retriever. We're in. Out. Retriever to worm bait. Stay in. Don't go out. Understood. Out. No, in. Out. Understood. Out. Look, you're on the far side of the top, right? Affirmative. Good. Then make lots of noise to draw the guard worm away from the mattress so I can retrieve it. Affirmative. Out. Oh, that's why he calls himself the retriever. Why are we called worm bait? I don't know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Idea, Patrick. And my perfect plan falls into place. <laughs> SpongeBob? Yes, Patrick? I think I know why our code name is Wormbait. The, the nice worm. The good, kind, gentle worm. <laughs> SpongeBob, he likes your wooden spoon. Huh? Wow, I think you're right, Patrick. Safety boys catch. Okay, see the stick boy? Go get it, boy! <laughs> Coast is clear. Squiddy, you are a genius. Ouch! What the? Hey, I needed a wooden spoon. I'll just keep it safe from harm in my back pocket. And now for the mattress. <laughs> I should have guessed. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? <laughs> Patrick's my friend. Sometimes if he's eating worm food by mistake, he goes into worm mode. There's no telling how long it'll last. Well, if he's not trained in a few days so he can be adopted, he'll have to be locked up, like Butcher. <laughs> Don't worry, sir. I'll train him. He's already housebroken. <laughs> Uh, I knew he was broken. I thought it was house. Uh. Now, Patrick, every good worm needs to learn how to do tricks. Then they get wormy <laughs> treats as a reward. Set. <laughs> um, almost. Let's try another one. Shake. <laughs> Shall we try roll over? <laughs> Patrick, wait! <laughs> Rolling 
Star Express, right on time. I'll see you fellers in a couple of days. Bye, Sandy. Oh, wait, you forgot about this pet. Oh, that's only Wormy. He don't eat much. Look at him, Patrick. Isn't he great? Hey, little fella. Kitchy, kitchy, goo goo. Oh, look. Isn't he just precious? Let's take him out to play. 998, 999, 1000. Ready or not, here I come. You found me. There you are! <laughs> <laughs> no! He found us! A friend is a friend to the end of the end That's forever and a day Stay by your side, won't you be say goodbye Come what may, cause that's what friends do That's what friends do Cause that's what friends do Gee, SpongeBob, I don't want today to end ever. I know, Patrick. Days like today come once, maybe twice in a lifetime. Savor every moment. And it's all thanks to Wormy. I made this for Wormy, our new best friend. Until tomorrow, new best friend. Don't be sad, little buddy. We'll be back first thing in the morning for frolic and fun. Why must the sun set on this perfect day? Sleep well, Wormy. <laughs> but don't be sad, Patrick. It's only until tomorrow. If Seabears really exist, why didn't one show up? Maybe it's because you're not wearing your sombrero in a goofy fashion. Oh, pff, sorry. How silly of me. You mean like this? <laughs> no, like that. <laughs> Squidward, are you okay? No. Quick, jump inside our anti sea bear circle before he comes back. Yeah, sea bears often attack more than once. Are you crazy? A dirt circle won't stop that monster. I'm running for my life. No! Don't run. Sea bears hate that. Thanks for the tip. I guess I'll just limp home then. No! No! Limping more than running. Bye, Spotty. Bye, Plankton. Have a nice trip. Looks like it's just you and me, Spot. Spot? <laughs> oh, Plankton's instructions. Spot, be at Amoeba. Oh, who needs Plankton's little notes? A sophisticated AI like myself should have no problem with a simple organic being. All he needs is a basic analysis. No! I'm not done analyzing you! Spot! Heal, boy! Heal! Uh-oh. Is he supposed to do that? Hmm, maybe he needs a little pumping up. <laughs> there you go, Spat. <laughs> I killed him! All right, let's see. Uh-huh. Decent stock length. Ooh, good hinge action. Ah, oh, foofy. Excellent brow stretch. Well-defined eyelid capillaries. Foofy is looking as good as ever, Charles. Why, thank you, sir. 
Okay, let's have a look-see, shall we? Ah, yes. Good spacing on the larynx. Nice gastric chamber. All within breed description. It's in the bag. Now, if we could just check the undercarriage. Ah! <laughs> Gary, no! Gary, you spit him out right now. I'm sorry, he usually only bites me. Display. At least I know you'd never behave like all these heathens, right, Foofy? Foofy? Foofy! This is too cute! I'm having a cutest attack! Oh, hi, Spot. <laughs> oh, that is the cutest thing I've ever seen. It's so cute. I can't breathe. Oh, I need water. Oh, it's too cute. It's too cute. Too cute. Too cute. Too cute. <gasps> that garbage can looks like Squidward's house. Aw, that Squidward-looking urchin must be one of Gary's pals. Can this day get any more adorable? SpongeBob! No, oh, it can now. Get your trash can off of... Oh, oh, oh. Hi, Squidward! <laughs> what the...? <laughs> Ew. It looks just like that moron. What's that? Is that supposed to be me? Oh, that's... That's... The cutest thing I've ever seen. It's too cute. Adorable. 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 Adorable.